Hi everyone, I'm John from Wiley Visuals and in this video I want to give you a quick pro tip for customising your Pelican cases or other similar hard cases that you're using to store your camera gear. Most of the time when you buy a Pelican case or even one of the similar cases that you can get from your local hardware store, it comes by default with this perforated pre-cut foam. The idea is pretty simple. You figure out where you want your gear to go and then you cut and pull out those sections to make space for your items. The problem is that this pick and pluck style foam can deteriorate really quickly. Within a couple of uses, you'll probably start to notice that some of the pieces around your items are coming loose. And after a few months of day-to-day -day usage, that foam can basically start to look like a box of loose Lego bricks. There's a couple of other options for how you might want to organise your Pelican cases, but these can be costly and complicated. Trek pack dividers or laser cut foam both cost a lot more than the case themselves. Trek pack dividers are only available made to fit for genuine Pelican cases but do offer a lot of flexibility, while with custom laser cutting, you're basically locked in and all that money is wasted when you need to change your case's layout next time. All of those issues are why a lot of people choose to just stick with the stock foam inserts that come with most of these cases. But there is a way to really improve the durability and usability of this foam, and it's one that I'm so glad I discovered recently. There's a product called Plasti Dip, which is basically a spray-on rubberized paint that is fantastic for coating pick and pluck style foam. There might be other products available from other brands, but this is the one that I can personally vouch for as I've used it on a couple of my own cases now. When you spray this on, it creates a sort of rubber coating on the outside of the foam that bonds it together really well. And because this style of foam is so porous, it sinks in nicely too. So it's not just coating the surface, it gets really deep into those blocks and joins together those perforated tabs until they really do feel like a single solid piece of foam. You can see an example here on my camera case where even if you push or pull on there, you can no longer even see where the joins are between those foam tabs. So it's gonna be really difficult for any of them to start coming loose or separating. Since I started using this, I've found my cases to be so much cleaner and more durable. And given that the price is only slightly more than a six pack of beer, it's excellent value compared to other options out there when it comes to customizing your cases. So next time you purchase a new home for your valuable camera gear, I highly recommend that you give this a try. It's made my life a lot easier when storing or traveling with my camera gear. I hope you found this video helpful and if you're looking for more tips on video production, be sure to hit the link below and subscribe. I'll catch you next time.